Good afternoon, good morning, good evening, good whatever. Welcome back to my channel, guys. The channel of the Italian guy. Two weeks ago, I uploaded a poll on my YouTube channel asking uh, you guys to choose the next video recipe, keto video recipe. And uh, unfortunately, <laughs> the, the video recipe that I'm going to show you today, the Italian Taralli, uh, to, uh, got the, la the lowest number of votes so I had to postpone it I had to make the first the keto pasta the fourth version then the keto pancake and today finally the keto Italian taralli the pizza flavored so tomato is not keto but we can do some uh, how can I say tricks cheats to include it in our macros if you uh, follow the keto diet with uh, the keto lifestyle sorry i don't consider it a diet the keto lifestyle with macro i don't but i did some calculations for you anyway follow me in the preparation of this delicious keto recipe <laughs> let's begin our preparation 70 grams of flax seed flour as most as refined as possible 18 grams of bamboo fiber 1 salt to taste xanthangum i forgot 1 tablespoon of xanthangum then finally salt to taste to finish the dry ingredients yeah yeah we are now let's mix together and uh, let's combine the those dry ingredients uh, very well so that everything is blended together do you want to know the recipe for the taralli with the white wine and uh, fennel seeds give me 100, 500 like please and I will tell you we are over 2,000 subscribers so I think we can do it one egg liquid ingredients and 50 grams of tomato concentrate follow me until the end of the video we will do some uh, considerations about the tomato is keto is not keto the tomato concentrate and so on xanthanga and blah 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 now since, since this is a pizza uh, recipe pizza flavored recipe we add oregano as uh, like the salt as much as you want so it's up to you okay now we start to combine the uh, wet ingredients as well at first the dough will be dry but don't worry do not add any more liquid keep kneading the dough as I'm doing right now keep kneading you see the the dough is becoming more uh, uh, softer it's becoming softer it will be sticky as well but keep kneading i speeded up the video keep kneading the dough will not be sticky anymore let's dust the uh, the dough with some bamboo fiber i split the dough in two parts but if you have a larger counter a larger chopping board you can decide to make a long sausage one centimeter of di diameter i don't know in uh, in other uh, measurements <laughs> one centimeter anyway you can see now from uh, the video and now let's cut them and uh, you can make the shape of the the tarali uh, is the gazantangam needed mm, as you can see look look the magic of the gazantangam I'm not sure because most Italians tell me can I avoid this can I avoid that they don't know you know we are not as uh, uh, can I say updated as the you guys from uh, other nations and uh, <laughs> they always ask me if they will they can avoid the xanthangam anyway I don't know in I am sure in other countries it will be different look look how this uh, gluten free dough behaves just like the gluten one you know yeah a little crack here but nothing serious be sure to seal the borders uh, in the front and back side 
because we are going to boil them for, for one minute and they will open up. So as you can see in the video, be sure to seal perfectly both sides, back and forth. And here we are. So uh, with the, the, the doses I gave you, the, um, we are able to produce 23 taralli. So of course it depends on the size, but more or less we are around 20, 20 taralli. Okay, now we go to the first part of the cooking. When the water boils, throw the taralli inside, 23 in my case. And in less than one minute, they will start to float on the top, like gnocchi. Then when you see this happening, be ready to transfer the taralli from the pot to the oven tray. Uh, you see, they are coming on the top now. Yeah, they changed color as well. So let's take a ladle and uh, with holes, so to get rid of the water. And let's move them on the, the oven tray. 392 Fahrenheit and the temperature fan oven 25 minutes and uh, let them cool down with the door ajar the door oven uh, ajar and then they're ready okay here we are I can assure you they're really delicious Unfortunately, I was not able to spare them. We ate them all, so there's nothing now to show you. But if you have a look at the Italian video, you should see by the end the, the tarallo, <laughs> the tarallo in my hands. I'm sorry for this. And so some consideration about xanthan gum is really needed. You could, you could, uh, you could, uh, you could use psyllium. If you don't have xanthan gum, I think 30 grams would be enough to replace the xanthan gum and give the, uh, the dough the elasticity it needs. So when you bend them like this. Um, tomato, tomato is keto. You can definitely eat tomatoes in a, on a keto lifestyle, but of course you have to be careful to the carbohydrates because one is keto, two tomatoes are keto, but then if you keep adding, the sum makes the total, I say, so you can, you can go behind your limits, 20, 40 grams of uh, carbohydrates in a day, so be, be careful. And then regarding the concentrate, as you can see, I use this Italian one, also always look at the label. In this case, 17 grams for uh, out of 130 grams of product, so by doing the math, you can, uh, we have used 6.5 uh, 6 carbohydrates on the total uh, recipe, so on all the 23 taralli that came out. Uh, so it, it, we can definitely eat it in keto. But of course, if you keep eating, you can other things like uh, almond flour, cakes with almond flour in the same day. You have to be careful to the total amount of carbohydrates. So that's it. I hope you liked the video. There is another poll. I will. I already uploaded it. So please have your say. You can choose the next video recipe among four ones. So you you guys choose the next recipe. Uh, if you like the video, please share it on your Facebook walls, Instagram, Twitter, whatever. You will help me to gain more followers uh, other than Italian ones all around the world and subscribe to the channel. See you at the next, uh, at the next video recipe. Ciao!